One. Hey, hey everybody. everybody! I'm Will. I'm Adam. And I'm Sam, and we are Working, working Title! title. <laughs> Alright guys, a lot of stuff came out between Marvel and Star Wars. We've re already reacted to a couple things, and right now we're about to get into Sizzle, Miss Marvel. So this is Sizzle Reel. Uh, I'm assuming, right? I don't know what sizzle is. Do you know what sizzle is? No! <laughs> I'm assuming when it says sizzle, it, says, it means sizzle real for Miss Miss Marvel. Uh, what do you guys know about Miss Marvel? Uh, Clearly nothing after that conversation we just had. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was Captain Marvel. Kamala Khan, Avenger. Oh, well, I'm just guessing they're going to use the Avengers character. New Avengers character from the Marvel Avengers video game that is a good game. Yeah, I, I, I know her ability. I'm not going to say it just because I, I know he doesn't know it, so, yeah. uh, and we might see it in the trailer. Yeah. Um, I'm interested. I I think she is pretty cool in the game from the gameplay I have seen, uh, so I won't say anymore. Yeah. Let's just jump into it. Here we go. Sizzle. Hey guys, if it's your first time here, leave a like for the video if you enjoyed this content. If you want to stay tuned and figure out when we're dropping more Marvel series, when we're reacting to everything, hit the subscribe button, flick the notification bell, stay tuned in, leave a comment for what you want us to see, how you felt about the video, and your suggestions. And guess what, baby? We're going to punch it. <gasps> Bye! And I... Oh, Miss Marvel is a new kind of superhero. But at the core of all of it, her story is so universal. Miss Marvel is one of the newer characters in the Marvel comics. And when one comes in, it grabs the world's imagination like this. The questions are, when are we going to bring Miss Marvel to the screen? When Miss Marvel first came out, oh, I've seen such that such an incredible reaction. It was so incredibly popular because everybody could see themselves in her. I never saw a young teenager of color, specifically a Pakistani, in a comic book. Are you kidding? I promise you'd be cool. I am cool. The casting process was vast. When we discovered Iman, we knew that she was Kamala Khan. It was unanimous decision. Yeah, I can't this right. <laughs> and of course, we've got a really awesome. incredible team of directors: Bilal Falah, Adil that guy's got sick hair. That's cool. And Charmin Obey. That dude's fit is awesome. All of them are taking the material and elevating it. So human. It's about a teenager figuring out who she is and about relationships, family, and friendship is at the heart of the MCU canon. That's what's so exciting about the story that we're bringing is that we're going to introduce you to a new family that's also going to be part of the wider MCU. Nice. Cool. cool. That's awesome. I like that. I like the yeah. font of that. Yeah. yeah, that's a great logo. Good oh. design. So I'm just excited because it. This is like a we really haven't good seen that segue much. for like. A younger generation of heroes. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so the way... I'm not going to spoil how the game goes. If you guys like to play the game, play it yourself. <laughs> yeah. If these guys want to play it, they'll play it eventually. It's it's completely... The way the game is set up, it's completely different from Disney, okay. Marvel. Yeah. Um, actually, it's, it's in human storyline. There's uh, the Avengers, specifically Tony Stark and... The guy that became becomes Black Dr. Murdoch. Modoc. Murdoch. Modoc. It's Modoc. Modoc. Dr. Modoc. Modoc. Whatever. The guy becomes Modoc. Big head fella. He, him, and Tony are working on something. It goes. Somebody tries stealing it. It goes wrong. It blows up, and it causes mutation that causes mm. inhumans. Mm. Ah. And in that, is she an inhuman? In that she is, but I don't oh, know what's like. But that it's a completely different universe. Like, okay, yeah, it's a it's a different it's, take. Um, Maybe they could tie this into the New Mutants. Yeah, th there's a lot that happens. Character, some characters die who are like main characters, yeah. or you think are dead. You know, it's, you know, it's it's a big deal. So um, it's different than the Disney Marvel canon. So I would assume they're going to go a different route with this. So I don't know what her backstory is going to be. Okay. She's a cool character. One thing yeah. I'm really excited for is this. Um, I don't know. I got really happy. This is very like wholesome. Well, first off, like congrats to the girl. Yeah. Got, yeah. You know, good job. Good job. Good job. Happy for you. Also, you know, get to be like you know represent your your people and like have the first like uh, I mean Pakistani Pakistan Pakistani Pakistan. Yeah. you know hero. That's awesome for yeah. them. And. But anyways, it just feels like it's gonna. It feels like it's gonna be good, wholesome, like family and something to bring up, like, like let like young girls be excited about like superhero sure. hero mm -hmm. stuff. So it makes me happy, and like you said, it gives an opportunity for new young heroes that like yeah. kids like that are younger than us get to grow up on. Yeah, yes. and this is kind. Of, I feel like this will kind of be like what I wanted from the Netflix series. 
the the thing with the Netflix series is they were really good, but they never really associated themselves as if they were a part of the movies. Like you could watch them and not even know that Iron Man exists. Like it's like never brought up. Maybe yeah. once in the first season of Daredevil, and then never again do they really talk about it. It's it's just their own stuff. Yeah, it's just focused on them. And what I wanted from those, not that they weren't great or anything, but like it would have been nice for them to like we get to see the perspective of like just people in their daily lives and how that like how the bigger movies impact like what yeah. it is and this feels like you might be getting that where it's like she gets to see these heroes and also get to be a hero in the mix that just isn't known by them yet yeah so this could be a really cool experience and probably a a big segue for just a younger generation of heroes yeah being the next avengers because we were talking about like Iron Man and Cap aren't a part of the story anymore. They're gone. The big three's and, gone. And yeah, and we don't know Thor's, you know, <laughs> doing Thor with whatever he wants and to the do. Galaxy just and the galaxy just not galaxy far, yeah. far away. So it's like we need a new group of people to eventually take the mantle. So this is that stepping stone. So we'll see. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah. Yeah, I don't I don't know much about her. They didn't show what her power was. Um it's, but it's cool to see they already so, have stuff filmed. So yeah. yeah. We'll let Adam, I guess, have his natural reaction what her ability is when it comes to play. I'm assuming it's the exact same as the game. Could be new. Yeah. Could be something different. I'm in the hot seat a lot, and yeah. I don't like it. <laughs> it's really hot. Honestly, I wish I was in that position where I get to just have, have, have a real natural reaction. A real, reaction. like, like well, excitement to not knowing. Guys, thank you for coming out to watch this trailer. If you've stayed this long, you've cl you're clearly a Marvel fan. So if you want to see people react to Marvel, we're going to be doing it. We're going to be watching Loki. We're going to be watching this Marvel. We're going to be watching... Uh, Winter Soldier and the Falcon we're going to be watching WandaVision those are all coming out fairly soon uh, so stay tuned make sure you can see all those reactions but first you gotta subscribe you gotta like these things you gotta comment let us know what you think about Miss Marvel what do you think we're going to be getting out of her character and her story and how it's going to play in the grander scheme of the universe we're also watching shows like The Mandalorian right now Attack on Titan uh, so check out those playlists and we're going to be watching a whole lot of other shows coming soon we'll see you in the next videos happy holidays happy holidays yeah, punch it BAH!